Hi guys, it's Joanne from 15 Spatulas. Today we're gonna do something extra fun. We are going to make a waffle iron grilled cheese sandwich. Now, of course you can make a grilled cheese in a pan or in a panini press, but what I love about doing it in the waffle iron is it makes for these crispy nooks and crannies. So it's kind of a different texture. So the first thing we're gonna do is butter our bread, and I've got two slices of white sandwich bread here. You can either buy some or make your own, and I have a video on how to do that. I'll give you a link at the end of the video. So we want to butter the bread and not the pan, because it'll give it a crisper texture. But butter can be kind of hard to spread straight out of the fridge, so I like to use a spreadable butter that has butter, sea salt, and olive oil, and it makes it much easier to slather on the outsides of the bread. So I'm just going to spread butter on one side of each of these sandwich slices. Next, I'm gonna cut up my cheese, and I'm gonna use a sharp cheddar today. But I also like to do Gruyere. I like to do a combination of brie and mozzarella, because the brie is kind of gooey and melty, and the mozzarella is stretchy and stringy. But you can pretty much do whatever cheese you'd like here. So I'm just gonna slice this up for my sandwich. So I've already got my waffle iron preheated, so I'm gonna take buttered side, place that down on the top. I'm gonna add my cheese slices and spread them out evenly. And then I'm gonna have the buttered side on top. And then I'm gonna close the lid, and I'm not gonna smash this at all. It'll kind of collapse on its own and compress as it cooks. And I'm gonna let this cook for about three to five minutes until it's golden brown and crispy. Once the bread is golden brown and crispy and the cheese is all melted, you can take it out of your waffle iron. And if you're looking for that video on how to make homemade sandwich bread, I put a link in the screen above. And if you're on mobile or tablet, I put it in the description box as well for you. Hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time. Ooh, gooey cheese.